This question is about phase difference. A progressive radio wave in a vacuum has a frequency of 75 megahertz. What is the phase difference between two points on the wave that are 50 centimeters apart from each other? This wave represents a section of the radio wave. And uh, I will have, let's say, one point here and the other point right here. And the distance between both points here is 50 centimeters. So this is P1, this is P2. So that's the the difference between both points. In this case, the phase difference is related to the distance between two points on this radio wave, and both points are 50 centimeters apart from each other. And basically, the question is asking to convert the 50 centimeters in degrees. To relate 50 centimeters with the wavelength of this radio wave, we need to calculate lambda. The wave equation has three variables. Is the speed of the wave, or V, go on the top of this triangle, because it looks like a V upside down, so that's V. And the other two variables is wavelength and frequency. So, from this triangle, we can derive three formulas for each one of these variables. In this case, we need to find the wavelength. So the wavelength is V over F. Wavelength is V over F. The speed of a radio wave is the speed of light because radio wave is part of the electromagnetic spectrum. And that's, so V here is three times 10 to the eight meters per second. This is the speed of light of a radio wave. And frequency, let's see, okay, the frequency was given on the heading of the problem. The frequency is 75 megahertz. So 75 mega is a prefix, so we need to add the multiplier so times 10 to the 6 hertz, which is 1 over second. So 1 over second and hertz is the same thing. So 3 EE8 divided by 75 EE6 is 4 meter. Now I want you to take this opportunity to show you how we work with the units. So the... The velocity here is meters per second, so we keep meters per second. It's the same thing as a kind of fraction type. And here is one over second, so it is a fraction on the denominator. So I'm going to flip, and that will be second. So now I cancel second with second. So that's why my wavelength unit is meter. So that is the wavelength of this radio wave. Okay, so one complete wavelength is equal to 4 meter. And one complete wavelength is also equal to 360 degrees. Okay, so now the phase difference is 50 centimeters and the wavelength is 4 meters. So to compare apples with apples, we need to change this unit. I'm going to convert 4 meter to... Um, centimeter, so you'll be 400 centimeter. Now I'm going to establish the ratio. So one complete wavelength corresponds to 360 degrees. To relate a wave with angles, I'm going to use this circle here um, and walk counterclockwise with the angles here starting from 0 degrees, then to 90 degrees, 180 degrees, 270 degrees, and 360 degrees, which corresponds to one complete cycle. So here is where I'm going to draw my wave based on how I move in a circle. So this is zero degrees, 
this is my 90 degrees this is 180 degrees this is my 270 degrees and a complete cycle is 360 degrees so establish here some uh, vertical limit top and bottom must be symmetrical and that uh, we start at zero now we are gonna make like a drawing based on this motion zero then we went to 90 degrees and then 180 degrees 270 degrees and finally 360 degrees now i'm going to connect all these dots um this 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 one and this one so that way i have converted um the degrees in circular form into a waveform so one complete wavelength corresponds to 360 degrees so now that i have explained this statement a wavelength is equal to 360 degrees and i have the value of the wavelength which is four meter or 400 centimeter is equal to 360. then 50 centimeters which is the phase difference in centimeters will correspond to which value in degrees so 400 divided by 50 is 8 centimeters cancel is equal to 360 degrees over the value that i want to find so my phase difference in degrees is 360 divided by 8 so the phase difference in degrees is 45 degrees so that's my final answer which is my option b